Hey, yo, what's going on, guys? It's your boy Running. Coming back with a new video today. We're going to be looking at Michael Capito. You know, um, running back, linebacker, and cornerback for them. Uh, uh, for Island Tree Division 4. I, I looked it up. I just looked it up to make sure that it's right. You know, uh, I could definitely see this team actually. Because Division 4 isn't as, like, loaded as Division 3. It doesn't have, like, a number one contender as Division 1, 2, and 3 has, I feel like. Because Division 1, it's almost always Massapequa. Division 2... Almost always Garden City or Manhasset. And then Division 3, it's recently it's just been plain. It just has been dominating that. But this kid's got, like, talent. He's got talent. He, you see, he makes these plays, comes out, gets outside, look ready. You know, comes up, and he's just able to make plays. You know, this is the athlete. He's the athlete. He's the reason why this team went 3-4. and four. Uh, You know, didn't have a winning record, but, you know, could have went 4-4 four and four depending on some things um because of covid but they made playoffs game got canceled because their team got covid but yeah this team's a solid team you know has a has just solid player in this running back right here he's a versatile weapon you know use him at, at receiving they, they they use him as a receiver often they use him as a wing they use him as a wing they don't use him as like a running back basically they don't have him in the backfield that they have him in the backfield but they have him as a wing he's not a he's not a true type of running back he's a wing he's got that He's a wing type running back. And he's there for that play. He's the one that caught it. He was there and he was patient. He was able to make a play right there. That's a nice job right there. He's patient. He's able to make a nice play. You know? See, so they have him at wing, but like you see, he do he also receives. Like he's not just he's not just catching it. He's right there and notices that the ball is not gonna be easily caught by his teammates, so he makes the play and he's able to make a play. See so what he does on the defensive side though. Patient, gets off a block, and he's just able to make a nice tackle. Dra looks, drags him backwards, you know. That's what I like to see. I like to see when they get dragged backwards. I don't like them being dragged forward. But he's just able to make a nice play. You know, just just has a nice ability and makes a lot of good plays right there. Look, nice job. Was patient, faked the out, and there was nobody even close to him that he was just able to make a play. You know, they're both following the guy that was sprinting out. Nobody was guarding him, and he was just able to make a nice play right there. See what he does here. You know, he, he looks like he's going to be their number one target. You know, next season, if they're going to make a champ, if they're going to make a run to like, you know, at least to their county championships, you know, he's going to be the one to help them do it. You know, he, he's the one leading this team. Let's see what he does on the return, though. You know, when he's making cuts, it seems like he's not really making cuts. And when he does, he's doing them with his long strides, not making it with the short, choppy strides. You know what I'm going to say? Like, I, like I've, I think. I watch a lot of football and I listen to a lot of like different players and I've I've heard Devin Hester and Deion Sanders always say this. If you're gonna try and make moves, short choppy short choppy steps is what you gotta do. You gotta do these short choppy steps and it really doesn't seem like he's doing it that much. Like, you know, saw that cutback, he was taking a wide step back. You need these short choppy steps to make those types of plays. But you know, this kid's he's he's got he's got the athletic ability to take him to a place where like, you know, they you wouldn't expect them to be. And he's just Gonna make them become a good team. Uh, yeah. You know, they focus more on a lot more things. You know, he'll be able to make a lot better plays. You know, you see that forces the ball out on that last play. You know, see what he does. Nice, gets a nice block out. You know, seems like he can block pretty well. You know, he's not just a single type. You know, I'd say if anything, they're gonna if they switch to a different type of offensive formation, you know, put him at, um, an inside as an inside receiver or even a tight end because this kid's he's physical you know you could switch him to running uh running back sometimes but you know if you're just gonna if you want him to block you know this kid can block he's a hard-hitting blocker it seems like you know you don't expect a kid that plays um receiver and running back that the, that plays running back but that catches like a receiver you know be able to block like him you know just able to make a play and then right here you know, doesn't re uh, realizes the screen. He's just able to make a play. See what he does here. You know, gets the pitch outside, able to get up the field. You know, gets some nice yardage. You know, jukes a little bit, but he jukes too. He does it too much. He does it with too much energy right there that it just doesn't look good right there. Another nice job reads the screen before once he sees that he's going outside. He's able to come up the field and make a nice play. You know, it's wide open. You know, quarterback doesn't give him the best pass, and he's just able to get up the field and just get some nice yardage right there. 
Let's see. Again, another nice play right there. You know, gets deep. You know, doesn't get in the end zone, but he's able to make a nice play. You know, these kids are athletes. This kid's an athlete, and he's just proving why. You know, running through him, he doesn't stop. You know, he drives him back. You know, that's a nice play right there. You know, gets up the field, makes a nice block right there. You know, but he goes down after he made that block, which wasn't something, you know, wasn't the best idea. Let's see what he does, you know, on the block on the return, you know. Let's see what he does here. You know, kind of takes a guy out. See what he does on this block. It's not him returning, it seems like. So, you know, but he's not, he's paying too much attention to up ahead. Like, doesn't focus on what who's in front of him. You know, that's not the smartest thing to do. Is he's not paying attention to who's in front of the guy that's returning sometimes. Who's just not making a nice play, you know. Like, he can make plays, but it's just like, you know, there are times where, you know, he's not focused enough to make the right play. That's where right there he's making a nice tackle for a loss right there. See what he does here. It seems like it's going to be a touchdown because it's such a short yardage. able to be physical. Let's see. Nope, just gets good blocks, get in the end zone. But nice, nice carrying vision of seeing it and being able to make a play. You know, let's see what he does here. You know, kind of just jumps on him, like doesn't really like try and push him back. That's I want to see the guys push him back because, you know, it helps. It's it's good to push him back because you don't want them to get yardage. You jump on top of them. What is it going to what's going to happen? What's going to happen? They're going to be able to drag you at least a few more yardage. Uh, drag them. Get dr drag. Yeah, drag you a few more yardage. And you're just not going to be able to make a good play. Yeah, gets outside. Gets a nice first down, you know. But it's a scrimmage. Like, I'm not going to be talking like this is... Unless you do something that's, like, uh, crazy for you. But, you know. Like, this is just, like, you know, it's a scrimmage. Like, I know it's a scrimmage and all. And, like, you know. Like, you know. But it's, like, you know, you need to show, like... You know, the pressure isn't as much on. That's a good play right there. Just grabs his feet, able to hold on to him, able to make a play. You know, kid's a, kid's, a, kid's a nice player. You know, he's got some athletic, he's got athleticism. Definitely could lead this team again to playoffs. Maybe second round, possibly to the uh, county championships. I don't know if they could win, but he definitely could help this team become something a lot better than what they've been recently. But yeah, guys, remember to like, subscribe, comment down below if you guys enjoy these types of videos. Peace.